Greetings, good afternoon, morning, or evening, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Thanks for being with us. I'm Jeremy Larkin with the Larkin Group, and we appreciate you taking a few minutes to look at the Washington County Real Estate Report or whichever report appeals to you in your area. I want to take just a couple of minutes and show you how to quickly read it and get the most out of the report, save you time in the future. It is easy to read, but I think my guidance will help out. Appreciate you looking at it. We're For today's purposes, we're going to go ahead and look at Washington County versus any of the individual cities. We produce a report for Ivan's, Santa Clara, St. George, Washington City, the Hurricane Valley, which is Hurricane Leverick and Tokerville, and then we, of course we have a county report. But for today's discussion, let's just look at the Washington County report. Of course, on the first page, you'll notice that this was produced Monday, January 7th. This report is updated the first Monday of every month. The really cool part is if you came over, for, for instance, from our soldinsaintgeorge.com website, you either came here from soldinsaintgeorge.com or gosaintgeorge.com, you don't have to, to change anything. The link never changes. These links are always the same, but the first Monday of every month, they're updated. So I've clicked on Washington County, and here we are. All of our contact information is on the front page in case you or someone you know, of course, have questions about buying, selling, investing in real estate. But let me give you a quick overview and save you some time and trouble. Um, the report has several pages. The first couple of pages are notes and commentary. And the notes and commentary are really great if you love to look at analysis. Some people won't, and that's totally okay. We get that if you're less analytical. For instance, this page talks about number of properties for sale, the black line versus properties under contract. And then it talks about what's going on in the market. Most folks are going to be interested, I'm scrolling down to this page right here, which is simply the market summary. It's the, the, the statistical summary. And you're looking at several things here. By price range, in your city, in this case Washington County, it's going to tell us how many properties are for sale, actively for sale. How many contracts are pending? This is where buyer goes to a seller and says, essentially, will you marry me? And seller says, yes, I will. And they, they enter into a contract to close later. Off market in the past six months, this is how many homes in an individual price range didn't sell or failed to sell. And amazingly, 40% of our listings still don't sell in Washington County, which is a separate discussion. It's a pricing, marketing, or staging issue. How many sold in the last six months? And then this last number, which is really fun, absorption rate. How many home months it would take to sell all the homes in a given price range? So let's just take two to 300,000 today. There are 350 for sale. They've been on the market an average of 118 days, about four months. 78 of the uh, homes in that price range are under contract. So about 18%. That's an okay ratio. It's not bad. It's, it's not wonderful. 259 have not sold in the last six months. About 40% of this number. And then, excuse me, actually of that number, it's probably more like 80%. And then 350 have sold. So what we know is about 60 homes sell per month in that price range. If we take 350 and divide it by six, we get 58, so 60 homes per month sell in that price range. The average days on market for those that sell is 121 days. If we scroll over to the very right, there's a six month inventory right now of 200 to $300,000 homes. And what we're finding is that those homes sell for 97% of the asking price. You can do the same thing for any price range. And of course you can do it by city. The last page, which will be helpful, is a glossary that tells you how to read it and what all this stuff means. So bottom line is we so appreciate you being here. Again, you can view the report at soldinsaintgeorge.com or gosaintgeorge.com every month, the first Monday of every month. And our contact information, should you have questions on this report or the buying, selling, investing process, reach out to us. Until next time, I'm Jeremy Larkin saying we know this town.